Mary? I just wanted to segue off something Susie said. She had brought up three development programs. And I know that Roberto has, would you mind speaking to your Blaine Wellness program that you introduced at the ranch and the wonderful, wonderful success that you've had with that? Because it speaks directly to what the three of you are talking about. Yes, thank you. Thank you for putting me on this well, our, our wellness, our employee wellness program started quite uh, frankly. We've been doing a, a lot of it, but in a very disorganized way for some time. And um, about two years ago, at a Green Spa Network uh, Congress, uh, a day spa owner stood up and told her story about an employee wellness program. And and to be honest, it, it was kind of it, it was a small program. It wasn't a really big program, but. It, it was very inspiring, and and that really sort of made me think: What are we doing for our employees, really? And and being a place that is there to help people get healthier, um, I looked to the other side, and I didn't think we were doing the same for our employees. So um, went over budget, as you know, and uh, but we created a very solid uh, program that uh, today is now. It's going to be a year since we introduced it. We've lost about a thousand pounds, uh, and we've lost about two percentage points on uh, fat in in the employees' body as a whole. So, it's it's been obviously the benefits are tremendous. Uh, in Mexico, you don't get that insurance benefit because you know the system is it's, it's a public system. But uh, what we have found is that our employees are happier. They're um, have a lot more vitality. Their families, the, the, the wellness program includes the family. So essentially what it does, what, what it is, is that we hire two doctors, a nutritionist, uh, three fitness people, and a psychologist. And they're all dedicated to employees only. Uh, they, they don't have to do anything with the guests, it's just for the employees. They're available seven days a week. Uh, we have um, you know, I don't know about productivity, but uh, 5.15 p.m., everyone hits the gym, everyone goes changes, and they, they take either Zumba classes, or, or they, uh, I think you got a picture of, of one of those classes from the ranch, or, or they take some other fitness uh, class. They, we do the hikings, obviously, in the ma at the mountain, and uh, we have a series of programs, uh, nutritional programs with the families, just, just to name an example, the other day I walked into a, a conference room and there was uh, the wife of one of our employees with her two daughters and the nutritionist, and they were talking about their progress at home. And, and I think that's a wonderful thing to do, and uh, I would hope that more industries do that. When, uh, I was having a conversation with some people about these issues on the health uh, and wellness uh, situation with, with uh, America and with the world, to be honest. And, uh, and then I was thinking about the hotel industry and, have, and the tourism industry. The tourism industry is a huge industry and if all of us did something like that, we wouldn't really have an issue with this health uh, situation. So we're very happy with that. We're hoping that more industries will get into it. We're actually beginning the process of formalizing that to take it outside of the ranch and to sell it to other industries in our community. And and I think it's going to be very well received and, and I think it's going to be a wonderful thing for, for him like that.